Gopi! Back with some more, Hunter Hunter. Okay, first off, I just real quick want to say, if you're seeing uh, this episode and you're like, Hey, Nico, where's episode 13? Uh, that episode was a recap. Recap episode. You guys have told me about it before, um, so I'm just skipping over it. I, I went and put my head in there just to make sure. I was like, okay, there's really nothing in here. No. The, basically, the first couple of minutes, you see that the woman that raised uh, Gone uh, received a letter from Gone, and it's basically just telling her all about the stuff that we've all seen. So I'm guessing maybe that marked it like a I don't know the end of the first season, and then the second half of the of this arc is the second season or something. That's really the only reason why I can think that they would do that. I I can't imagine they'd actually stick like a a recap episode in the middle of a season. That'd be really weird. But I don't know. I'm not sure how the release schedule for this went. So yes, you, you didn't miss an episode. There, there is no episode 13. It's just uh, 12 to 14. Uh, 13 would be a really boring one. <laughs> Let's go ahead and rewatch everything we just saw in smaller, bite sized, abridged form. Even more abridged. It's a reaction abridged, abridged. But anyway, when we last left off, we completed phase three of the exam. So I, I'm, I'm guessing as it is marking the middle of, or the halfway point for the arc, it's probably the halfway point for the exam. So there's probably two or three more phases from here. Based on that little, uh, little cliffhanger they left it, us with in the the final remark of it. we're gonna have to start fighting each other like ooh, I was I was thinking that might end up happening and it's got me really uh, nervous because I, I I don't think anyone could beat Hisoka out of, out of the group except for maybe Killua we haven't seen him really face off against him because he when everybody else did you know he stayed behind so that would be interesting to see. But I wouldn't be surprised if he was also outclassed by Ahsoka, you know? So, uh, I don't know. It'll be interesting to see how, how that goes. By the way, I do want to also clarify something. I, I I brought up last episode, like, okay, so I'm, I'm watching through to the end of this arc, which is around, like, episode 25 or 26. Um, some people are like, oh, well, what about the other stuff or something? No, 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 I, 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 want, I want to make clear. I'm, I'm basically treating the arcs of this series like separate games. So I'm basically going to watch through it. Once I have, I'm going to stop for a while. I'm going to probably do some other Let's Plays for a bit. But I will come back to it, and then I'll start the, the next arc, and that, that'll be like me starting a new game. Season 2 of uh, Hunter x Hunter. But yeah, I mean, unless I, the, the show t turns to garbage or something at the end here, I, I don't foresee myself, like, Getting tired of it and be like, oh, this is terrible. No, I mean, this has been pretty great so far. I, I've seen why people uh, have such a love for this series. So I, uh, I I only foresee good things. So, but yeah, no, I'll be checking out the other arcs. But, it, you know, I'll, 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 it will be between breaks, you know, the, like where I'll be doing other series. It'll probably get back to having two Let's Plays again. Since that really is kind of my bread and butter. Anyway, last episode, uh, Iraqo Rainey said, Okay, I'm going to ramble a little bit, but I absolutely love that little puzzle our ragtime favorite kiddos and Ton <laughs> Tarn Crappa had to face, and it's all for Gon's sake. As Nico pointed out, they could have picked the short one and then rescued the chained up people, or do as they did in the show. But it makes you think, how come Kurpika, a clearly intelligent and observant individual, or Killua, a well, highly trained assassin, or Liario, a clearly intelligent man who's just as observant of the others, his first bet in the last episode, didn't come up with any of these solutions? And that's because of the pressure. They are now pressed against the wall for time. If none of them even make it to the finish line, they can't pass. That's why Killua said the short path was, was their only option, narrow view, narrowing view number one. Tampa attacks in fear of being left behind forever, narrowing view number two. Liario begins to yell and fight back, which makes Kurapika and Killua also ready to fight, last narrowing. They become so frenzied due to time that they think that these are their only options. But Gon doesn't act like that. He's a mounted kid used to waiting a long time and thinking on his toes. He can work under pressure, which is a value the others in the group don't have. That or he's just naive, prob probably both. He does such a brilliant job of showing off this wonderful character trait in an almost passive way. He even gets praised for it, which for a young kid leaves an impression. If it's one thing Hunter Hunter does really well, it treats his characters with such respect. I, I gotta agree, I and I I've really enjoyed that. I've enjoyed seeing that consistency in, you know, their their personality. Uh, I mean, you know, nothing like crazy, like dramatic has happened that might suddenly shift it or something. But we've seen with the Killua, like, okay, if he finds something that is impossible or thinks it just isn't worth his time, he's not going to do it, right? And Gone, on the other hand, has good instincts for the most part and can think think on his feet real fast, even under pressure. And I think that's that was a really uh, uh, interesting analysis you did there, uh, Arako. So thank you for sharing with us, and it is for that reason you are our comment of the day. Oh, yes, and by the way... Uh, if you haven't been keeping up at all with my uh, social media, we just recently uh, made available brand new Hunter Hunter Picky Penguin plushies over at our Picky Penguin plushie store. So we're now selling Gone, Kilua, 
Liario, and of course, Kurapika. In addition to those, we also have characters from both Soul Eater, as well as My Hero Academia. Yoshi's really done an amazing job with these new ones. I'm, I'm super impressed with them. I love the Deku one in particular. And as you can see also, she's been developing a new uh, eye tech is what we're calling it, uh, which you can now choose to add on to your Penguin plushie instead of the regular uh, button eyes. You can now get the eye tech, which is like these basically like anime-esque uh, eyes that uh, go onto them. And it definitely, I think, work a lot better for from anime characters like, you know, My Hero Academia. So when you purchase it, make sure you choose uh, eye tech if that's what you want, or just the classic bun style if you prefer that. So, but yeah, I'll leave a link down below, or they'll probably t show up in the top right corner here for you to check them out if you're interested. Each plushie is super high quality and filled with Yoshi's love. And to those of you who have been uh, purchasing these plushies, thank you so much for both supporting both uh, Yoshi and myself. And we're really glad you guys have enjoyed these plushies as much as we've enjoyed uh, creating them. So, but it seems like now after we've completed phase three, we're starting to get down to the nitty gritty. The people who <laughs> have faces and personalities and interesting quirks about them um and i think uh things are gonna start ramping up here it's ooh, it's gotta be excited i i'm curious to see where are we gonna go from here will it will it just be like a straight tournament arc or will they turn on its head somehow well let's freaking find out baby hunter hunter episode 14 let's get started all right hit the target <laughs> did anyone immediately read that and hear that in the freaking in smash announcer voice hit the target uh, i missed that in smash ultimate kind of wish they brought that back okay 24 people have passed now Ah, uh, look at all these white variety of colorful people. Uh, that would look a little bit like uh, a Botan from <laughs> uh, Yu Yu Hakusho. Also made by Tagashi. And of course, the dynamic quad. Ah, there's Liara. Hello, faux hawk man. Oh, okay. The fourth and final phase. Two left, baby. All right. Wow. <laughs> and that's going to take up more than half of this arc. So these are going to be extensive. Zevil Island. Are you also going to be the examiner for that? Oh, boy. Here we go. Draw lots. Oh, oh man. Oh. <laughs> Hunt and who, who will be the hunter and who will be the hunted? Oh my god, I'm hunting man. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I would just be over there clutching my butt and crossing my fingers. Oh my god, please. Please don't let me be hunted by Ahsoka. And actually, please don't make me hunt Ahsoka either. He'll probably still kill me. Let me hunt Tampa, please. God. <laughs> this is one thing I wanted more than anything in the world. <laughs> let me hunt down Tampa. Like the fucking animal he is. Okay, we're drawing based on who exited the tower first. That means Ahsoka will get first draw. And again, still hasn't had any bandages for those boo-boos of his. Oh, you can see Gondos is like, oh, hey, somebody actually hurt him. Good old clickety neck. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> okay, man, you're just picking it up. Saitama! What you got, man? <laughs> He's just so nonchalantly. Are you gonna be fighting each other? Uh, yeah, probably. <laughs> probably gonna have to kill some people. Oh, well. Just another beautiful day. <laughs> we are, there's only two left, alright? Calm down. This isn't you feeling titty again. Oh, okay. Move the seal from your card. I see, nobody could actually see what theirs were yet. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. It gives them a number and they have to hunt them. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. That's actually a lot like the Assassin's Creed Online game. I don't know if any of you guys played that. I actually used to play that quite a bit. It was back in Brotherhood when it first started, and I, I played that one a bit. It's actually really fun. It was really different, too. But you basically, you play any one of a number of assassins, and you go on a level, and throughout the level, there are other assassins that look either just like yours or other other assassins that you can blend into so you don't know who the real one is and you're given a target and you're supposed to go kill that target um and the more you rack up in kills the more people are targeted to kill you as well so while you're trying to get your target you're trying to avoid getting killed by these other people and the more stylishly you kill them uh the more points you got it was really fun like i really enjoyed it it was something just totally different. But it's like that here. You're given a target that you have to kill, but at the same time, you're avoiding the person that's targeting you, right? That's, ooh, that's cool. I like that. Who's 44? Oh, so your target's ID tag. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, good. We don't actually have to kill him. By the way, you can kill him if you want to. <laughs> oh, is Hisoka number 44? Target's ID tag is worth three points. Oh, okay. So you're actually going to be still trying to grab other people's ID tags. I suppose maybe you could take it off the person you hunted and if they have a few ID tags of their own, right? And you need six points to advance. Oh my god, it is! 
Oh! Oh my god, Gon's gonna have to hunt freaking Ahsoka. Ooh! Wow, okay. That is really interesting. Oh, look at that island. Look, it looks like a pair of testicles. <laughs> oh, okay, we got a new guy here. Hello, Kara. Oh, that's nice. All the people here are qualified for next year's exam, assuming you don't die in the in the process of this phase. So if you die this year, don't feel bad. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, interesting, okay. And we're taking off the lapel so I couldn't just come over and grab it. And now that's reminded me a bit of like My Hero Academia, where you had to put those little targets on your body, try to put them in places where someone couldn't get to them very easily. Thank you. It's like, I'm getting the crap out of here. What's really interesting is we don't know we only know Gon's is. We don't know what anybody else's is. So, ooh. Actually, what would happen if you got... If you the guy you were chasing is also chasing you? That'd be really... That'd be mindfucky, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, Kurpika, don't red-eye me, man! Don't go your demon self on me! Don't batosai the manslayer on me! I'm just kidding, alright? I'm speaking happy that guy! Are you telling the truth, though? Hmm? Kilowatt. Kilua, I'm so boned. I gotta go after Ahsoka. Oh man, you're so lucky. I got stuck killing Liario. Ugh, it's gonna be so boring. It's <laughs> 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 so funny, they're so in sync now. They're such like the same wavelength. They're like, what's your target? I don't know, what's yours? I don't know. <laughs> and they just awkwardly sit there for a second before going, <laughs> Okay, 199. Hmm, okay. I know. Ugh. What's 199? Yeah, really! He's like, 199 is probably some generic side character no one gets a shit about. <sighs> oh, he doesn't actually... Oh. He doesn't even know what his, his, who his target is. Well, that's gonna be a serious disadvantage. Seem kind of excited, actually. Aw. They're little buddies now! Yay! So we don't know who 199 is. I wonder, is it someone they've even shown? Probably. You know what? I'm, I fucking, I want to know. I want to go back to the beginning. I want to find out who, who this was. I, I, they show all the people. Oh, there he is right there. It's this guy. Guy with the backward hat. He's 199. Oh, uh, okay. Ooh. Run in the jungle. Stay on the island for a week. Jesus. Oh my God. This is like battle fucking royale. Let's do it. Jump out the helicopter. We're going in. So he's like, oh good. I'm going to find me a nice vantage point and just snipe some bitches. Bye. I'm going to be camping my ass off. Actually, I need to go take a massive tiki. I've been holding it in a while. Crickety neck. <laughs> Lady's face. Kurpika, away. See ya, Bart. Go murder some ass, all right? Kill is gonna be done in about like 10 seconds. Ride the skateboard while you do it. Gone time. Oh, Lord. Okay. Uh, what word is it today? Um, hunt, hunted? Hunter. Hunt. One of those. Ah, damn it! Fuck! Monkey Gone doing what Monkey Gone does best. Climb trees. <laughs> ah, bad touch! I need an adult! <laughs> Oh, now that guy's camping. Look at him. Uh-oh. It's Arrow person. That guy's fucked. Ooh, that nose looks kind of messed up, man. What's up with people on the noses in this show? Go for the head, man. Go for the head. And for the brain, you're short in the pain. Do it. Do it. <laughs> oh! Nice spider sense there. Oh, uh-oh. Poison. Oh, tranquilizer. Okay. That was easy. Go on, going for the steel. Yeah. This is how you hunt God. This is how you hunt for people. These guys are on another level. So you just gotta think a few steps ahead of Ahsoka here. Ah, gonna harness his fishing skills. Try tossing it in the air and doing it. But yeah, that's assuming he's he's not gonna be wearing it though. He's gonna have it stuck in his like sleeve or something. Oh, there you go, gone. Nice shot, uh-oh. You guys are like, what is that kid doing? Oh, there you go, now I got a little froggy. Okay, now he's looking at the birdies. I think, oh no, he put something on the, to make it so that it wouldn't actually hook to them, right? <laughs> the first or second try or the 80th try. Meanwhile, Leorio is being hunted by Slender Man. I guess still watching him there, right? I actually wonder, if you get your tag taken, are you just immediately disqualified? Or can you still, like, get some other tags back? I don't know if they actually clarify that. Man, those birds are fucking quick. You must aim where it will go, not where it is. Oh. There we go. Okay. So now, he, so he's learned. Okay, I can't. I can't do it while they're flying in the air like that, and their their senses are still about them. But if he goes after it while he's trying to get a fish, right, then he'll get it. Cause their attention will be focused on something else. Here it comes. God is learning. Oh! Ah! Oh, I got it. 
I have to aim for my target as he hunts his own prey. Ah. Ah. Of course. Okay. Interesting. That's that's cool. So, follow Hisoka. Wait until he is going after his own person, which hopefully isn't you. That's clever. That's, uh, that's a clever way for him to, to learn that. Although... You have to hope that he doesn't see you while you're following him, which, with how sharp Ahsoka is, I feel like would be very difficult to get the drop on him. Uh-oh. Damn, we're at the end of this one already? Shit. I went fucking fast. That was interesting. That was, a, that was a good one. I, you know, that was a really short one, though. Like, I, especially towards the end there, there wasn't a whole lot to react to because he was just kind of doing the same thing again and again. So, uh, you know what? I think I'm going to do another one. So, I might regret this later, but... Uh, yeah, that, that was just kind of short for me, so let's, uh, let's watch another one. Don't expect me to make a habit of this, but that one really was fairly short. Okay, Explosion of Deception. Day 2 of Zevil Island. I'm surprised the, uh, the guy that was hunting him with the blow, the blow dart guy didn't try to attack him while he was doing this. I mean, his, his concentration is so focused on it. It's like it would have been a prime time for him to, like, I don't know, shoot him with a tranquilizer dart. Ooh, owie. Yeah, perfect accuracy. That is the power of the fishing rod. Get it, get it. <laughs> He's like, I look so badass. I'm a hint. Uh oh. What? What are the little butterflies doing? Oh god, are you like those little fuckers from earlier that were murdering people? Oh. Oh. They're attracted to the scent of blood. Ew. Gross, butterfly. Ew. You need to get out more, Mr. Butterfly. Ugh. Oh, hey. <laughs> Floating around him. He's still got that boo boo on him. Ah. Uh, that's how you'll find him. Yup. It is him. What are they doing? Why are they working together? Oh, hey, that's interesting. He actually took one of his pins out. So they're not actually attached, like permanently attached to his body. Oh, oh hey. Uh-oh, sniper lady about to go in, go over headshot. Boom, headshot. Huh, interesting. He doesn't know who his target is, Hisoka. Doesn't seem terribly uh, concerned about it. I guess more opportunities to hunt more people, right? Oh, my God. Oh, I thought they were. They are, they are. They're attached to a leash. <laughs> I got a butterfly leash. Yeah, there you go. That's why they pointed it out so much. Take me, butterflies. Take me. Thank God they're not just turning around and going after my... Oh, oh, that's right. He's got he's got a bandage on his hand now. That's why. Oh, damn it. They went back to that guy. No, bad butterflies. Oh, no, he's definitely dead now. Fly, Mr. Butterfly. Ew, no, that's not it, Mr. Butterfly. All right, have you had your fill yet? Come on, we got to do this. I did this right. It'd be funny. Little butterflies have like a little on duty, <laughs> like a servant, like a service dog. This is my service animal right here. My little butterflies. <laughs> All right, make sure I'm going to traffic, butterflies. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Ah! Oh, there he is. <laughs> Hanging out. Gone's a little scared to do anything. Ooh, just gotta wait. Just like waiting for that big fish, right? So we're just chilling the fuck out. Caught him bored. These butterflies are pissing me off. Go away. I don't smell that good. No, who am I kidding? I smell fantastic. <laughs> there, I'll just walk around with his briefcase. What do you carry around in that anyways? Medical supplies? Oh, he ate. He's finally whipping out the switchblade. Stab him, lawyer. Do it. Kill it. Take his badge and leave him to die. 191. Well, you're going to need to get six total points. I'm you're going to have to get some people that aren't your target anyway. Oh, no. Don't, don't show it to him, man. Don't trust Hump, uh, Leario. Don't show me your fucking card. 246. Ponzu. Ponzu. He could be telling him the wrong one, though, right? I say, like, oh, it's Ponzu, but it might not be. And what? Let me guess. He wants to exchange his badge, maybe? Oh, he wants some. You want some Pepto? Gross, Tampa got. Careful. I don't know if I. Oh, it's the Botan looking girl. Oh, that was her number on her shirt. I thought for sure he would lie to him about it. She specializes in all kinds of drugs. She sets a trap and waits for a target to arrive. Okay, well, it's going to be a lot of that going around. Okay, maybe instead he's just going to not tell him the correct information or tell him, or or hold back some information. Yeah, Tompa. Ugh, stop it. The guard's like, no, you die. <laughs> I'm going to leave you to die out here. Maybe he knows, or it could be he knows Ponzu is chasing after him, so he's telling him the wrong one so that he can get rid of the... The one hunting him. I, I don't know. I, I mean, No, but we saw the number. That was That's his target. That's definitely his target. Uh-oh. Boom! Uh-oh. No, dude! Oh, monkey man! Ah, yep. It, I was like, he's doing this. He, he's he's screwing him over some way. I, how is he doing it? Oh, that's it. That's how. That's fucking out. Why? 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 
why do you believe anything he says by this point? You are actually my target. Oh, shit. Oh. God damn it. They are go over and punch that monkey right in the dick. Boom. God, Thomas is such a fat shit. Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. I got some monkey man himself, isn't he? Look at him. <laughs> God damn it. How are you letting Topa outrun you? Come on, Leo Ariel. There's guns got underneath him, and Topa's a little fat fuck. Oh. Oh! 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 Yeah, Karpinka coming in for the fucking win, bitch! Boo! Yeah! Oh! That was so hype. Yeah! Oh, he just kicked the fuck out of Topa. Oh! God, I like Karpinka so damn much. Boom! Thanks, Karpinka. Yeah, man. Okay, uh, this word is diarrhea. Damn it, it's Target! Fuck! <laughs> that was really great, but it was diarrhea. <laughs> they are like, yeah, diarrhea! Remember, kids. So it's good to know that word. Oh, it's little woodland critters. Oh, oh man! Topa got fucked! <laughs> he got straight fucked! Boom! That's what happens, Tompa. That's what happens. That's karma. <laughs> Please do not feed! Get that monkey! Ah, <laughs> the monkey! Taste my hiney! Oh! Oh, Kurpika is just too fucking cool for school! I will murder your monkey. Ah, he joined him alongside Tulpa! God damn. Kurpika is the, is the friend you want to have in these, right? Like, god damn. <laughs> yeah, they are really showing he's... I don't know, man. I'm a big boy. Does he really deserve to be, be a hunter at this point? Because I feel like he's kind of riding on the coattails of Kurpika. I feel like everybody else there, he's... He's, I feel like he's being more of a, he's been more of a detriment th to others than he actually has been a help. I mean, he's done a few things right, I mean, but I feel like there's a serious difference in skill here. Okay, so that does answer my question. If you lose your tag, you can still get it back or get somebody else's tag, I guess. If the tags were one, eight, oh, oh yeah, for the, both of them, yeah. Oh, okay, Kurpika's, ah, Kurpika the one the jackpot then. Tompa was his target. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of right, Leario. You barely qualified. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I, I understand now. I understand now. So if you ha still have your own, that counts as three points for you. Like you, that still can be an additional three points. And with your targets, then you're good. You're you're totally done. Just as long as you don't get yours stolen. I see. Okay, so you really do just need to get your targets. So that's wh that's why Ahsoka was like, oh, I just need to get three other people. Because he wants more opportunities to, to fight different people, right? <laughs> Kirby is Liara's little buddy. He's helping him out of a lot of jams. Alright, Kyoa. Walking in the dark side of the woods. Oh! <laughs> yes! Let's play, motherfucker. Come at me. <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, so it's one of the three. And he's actually after... Uh, the bigger one of the three. I was like, come on, move, stupid! Like a gaunt's eyes are like glazed over. Oh, I I think he's talking to somebody else, though. Ooh, no, maybe he's not. Oh! Uh, uh, oh, there's somebody in the bush next to you! Ah! Ah! Oh, no! God's fucking hair! Oh! You work so hard to grow that hair out nice and nice and fresh too. I challenge you. This guy's nuts. Oh boy. Oh no, he is. He's just still wearing the pin on his shirt. He didn't put it away at all. Let's wait till the moment that he tries to kill this guy. This guy is so screwed. Oh. You cut my tree down. That was my sitting tree. Oh. Continue to avoid his attacks, you'll die eventually. What? Oh, oh, he's already been hurt. Tell from the swarm of hemotropic butter butterflies. Ah, damn it. Oh, interesting. I have no interest in the dead. <laughs> ah, wait a second. You're, all, you're already dead. <laughs> and I'm just going to sit back and watch you. Hey, he's going for it. Oh, oh, right in the neck, right in the jugular. Oh, I guess those, that, that, those guys, that guy's weapon too. Oh, okay. That was his target. Grant him one final wish, what to fight with Ahsoka? Or to kill him? Not interested in people who have no purpose. Only spare those whose deaths go, would go to waste. Oh, interest, interesting. Okay, so that's refer, like referring to what happened with Gon and Liario and Kurpika. So it feels like killing them would be a waste of potential, right? Ah, 80. Oh, snipe, sniper guy, girl. Uh, I guess it was a guy. Oh my God. I see you. Oh, right in the fucking eyeball. Dad! Whoa, what the hell? 
Whoa, what the heck is happening? What? Mm, skitty stuff. Whoa, whoa, hello! Uh, you look a little different there with those things off. What? What happened? Oh, wow, your hair got a lot longer, too. Whoa, that's some dead looking eyes there. What the? What are you? Now, what are you doing? D dig a hole, dig a hole, dig a hole. What? What? He just dug into the ground like Bugs Bunny! Like a little gopher! What? That was fucking weird. Why did he take the pins off? So I guess. I guess that's what he does when he goes to sleep? Why did he make his face look so different? <laughs> so I just. Just totally unfazed by it. Oh, God, it looks like you're gonna have to wait a bit longer. It seems like he hasn't nose gone yet. At least, seems like it. You I, you just, I would say far freaking away. Just as far away that I keep him in sight. He turned back around and see me. I'd be like, ah! Just pee myself. I see you gone. Hello? Uh oh. Oh no! Me. No! No! Oh, that's exactly who we didn't want him to target. Because now it's like he's waiting for him to attack. But Gon doesn't want him to attack them. Oh, all right. It's just getting fucking good. Oh, that was good. I really enjoyed that one. Man, I don't know what is up with Ahsoka and this other guy. I guess they're just working together to help each other get through the exam. But, like, how do they know each other? Who's the other guy? Why didn't when he take the pins off, his face went all weird? You know, weirder than it was even before? Oh, I just, I love seeing Tomba, though, get, get kicked to the fucking floor like that. Boom! Ah, oh, look for a more satisfying crunch? We'll look fucking no further. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoy that double whammy. It's probably gonna be a pretty tough one to edit, but uh, don't expect me to do that a lot. Like, like I've said before, you know, I would do two episodes in one if I could, but normally it's really difficult. And I feel like I would start cutting corners if I did it frequently. Uh, I'm doing here mainly because, like I said, that first one, there just wasn't as much to react to there, um, which I figured might happen at some point. So it ended up being a lot shorter, and uh, I felt like I could squeeze in one more, but... Uh, that and that the one we just watched that was a quite a bit meatier on the other hand so but anyway I hope you all enjoy this episode if you did please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe if you're not already become a picky penguin for the SLP where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny and as always guys till next time stay classy